Yes, yes, yes. Sun's gone past the yard arm. I'm Baron Borshyster, so it's time for another fable from Fartwell. Yes. So what are we doing today? Well, Ben the Builder, his jigsaw has stopped working and he threw it in the skip. Yes. Here it is. And we're going to fix it for him. Well, we're not going to fix it for him because, because we're going to give it to Lady Fartwell for her birthday because she likes jigsaws, apparently. They've always got a bit missing, but it's a bit like me, really. Cheers. So what is actually happening with this with this with this jigsaw? What is happening with it? Well, it's got a like an intermittent fault, like there's a loose connection. If you squeeze the trigger there, you see nothing's happening. The black battery's in, and uh, we've got no no power or anything. So you give it a bit of a bash. There we go. Oh, and it stopped again. Give it a bash. There we go. Nothing worse. Nothing worse than a. This is what Lady Fardwell says. Nothing worse than a than a. Than, a, than having a bit of a tool that doesn't doesn't work properly, you know. So what we're going to do, first of all, take the battery out, take the battery out. Oh no, no, don't take the battery out, put the battery back in. Right, first of all, we've got to diagnose it. <coughs> now this this particular machine, I don't know if you can see, I don't know if you can see the, the make and model of it there, but um, it's obviously different. So if you squeeze the trigger like this, you see, and um, it's not working. So in this slot here, I don't know if you can see this slot, you get something long and protruding. I've got my screwdriver. And if you poke it in there and you push it whilst holding the trigger down. There you go, you see? Now that is a sure sign that the bushes have gone. Yes, yes, the bush has gone on the jigsaw, yes. So we're going to get some bushes and we're going to put some bushes in the jigsaw. Right, so how do we do this? First of all, we've got to take out all that all the all the all the screws there's loads of screws in here now the ones take out all the ones on on the side but don't take out don't take out these four screws here these four screws here leave them in place so obviously take the battery off take the battery off okay. take off all the screws and then i'll get back to you and show you what to do next yes ben the builder he thought the uh, the, the jigsaw had gone on strike a bit like um lady fartwell lady fartwell went on strike and um she wasn't a very good she wasn't very good with her aim and she made the matches all wet and instead of throwing them away she uh, she gave them to the vicar and uh, to light the candles in the church and the only thing is the vicar he decided to go on strike and um, he just couldn't stop it you know he went all over all over the matches all over all over the altar and uh, yeah all down the aisle and the poor parishioners they all had to wear snorkel and masks for a week so um yes and so watch out if you go on strike yes so there we there we go we've got we've taken all these screws out now this is the bit that's a bit of a bit awkward you've got to be very careful here because there's a bit of a weasel there's a bit of a weasel in the woodshed and i'll show you what i mean by that in a minute but there's there's a spring in here that will ping out and just go everywhere so so you've got to be really careful and um so just start to prise prise this top bit off you see and you probably can start round around the edge you see here like this be putting the screwdriver in and twisting it a bit that's it prising apart gently 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 so very carefully take the top off like this there we go right here we go now i don't know if you can see this the best thing to do when you've done this is take a photograph take lots of photographs from different angles otherwise when you start putting it back together you go where the hell was that supposed to go now the weasel in the woodshed i don't know if i can show you this but there's a spring there's a spring here i don't know can you see that and what it does it pushes this this piece for the connections to the battery and if that pings out you'll you'll, you'll, you'll be crawling around on your hands and knees for the next six years so so what to do now? So to do it, what do we do now? Is we've got to take the bushes out. Yes. Now, where are the bushes? Well, this is this is obviously the slot where we push the screwdriver in to, to spin the to, to spin the motor, and this is the connecting wire here. So you take the connecting wire off. You see, just put it off like that. There we go. Which is what we'll actually do is we'll take these wires out of here as well. There we go. So we've got to take that out there. You see? And then 
we are, <coughs> you've got to get the bush out, the bush out, and the bush is here. And what you do, what I do is get the screwdriver in the back and give it a little wiggle there and a wiggle on this side, like this. And you can see it's coming up. It comes up, and can you see this? Can you see that? That's the bush. Now, this is the bush here. There you see, like that. There we go. That's the bush. And if you can have so, get another bush, and it's that one. So, put the bush back, the new bush in, like so. Get a bit short of that. Push that, push that down in place, like so. Clicks into place, and then put your. Oh, we won't put the wire. Back. Oh, yeah, we put the wire back. Yes, we will. Put the wire back, like so. So we know that one goes there. And then what we do, we, you've got to take this, you've got to take the um, this metal, all this metal here, out of the the plastic here. So it's sort of wedged in there quite tight. So you can probably get a screwdriver in there and give it a wiggle. It'll help it along its way. That's it. Come on. There we go. You see, that's come away from there. You see, and then we turn this over, and we've got the other, the other bush on this side. So, same again. Put the screwdriver in the in the back there, and. Give it a little wiggle, you see. Oh, that one's coming out quite easy there. You can probably just take the wire off. Take the wire off. You see that? Just give it a wiggle in there. The bigger screwdriver. There she comes. Look at that. There we go. And up we come. And there we go. There it is. That's that's that that one. And so we put the other one, the new one, back in. Like so, slide it down into place. Come on. Slide it down into place. There we go, she clicks into place. And put the, uh, just put the wire back on. There we go. And now what we've got to do is put it all back together again. So let's just do that. Now, obviously, that's got to go back over like that because we've turned it over and that goes back in like so there we go that, that those wires clip in round there there we go there we go we're back in there make sure that's all back in now we put this back on now, one of the things you want to watch for is the uh, trigger mechanism here, and this that part there is, is sometimes is a bit of a bugger. So um, make sure you get it lined up. And so let's, let's do that. See, it's, it's actually it's actually stopping it. It's not lined up, so it's actually stopping it from going down in place. The, the, the trigger. Come on. Put this back, put the screws back on. There we go. We've got to make sure that this um this this is clipped into place properly. There we go. Otherwise that can be the the this this guide can um can be out when you put the screws in. So make sure that that, that, that that's back in place. Right, quick bit of lubrication, yes. Cheers. Right, let's give it a go. Let's give it a go. Let's put the, let's put the battery in. See, see if Lady Fartwell's going to get a jigsaw for her, for her birthday. Yes. So here we go. Let's give it a squeeze. There, there we go. The weasel in the woodshed. That stayed there, so that was all good. And um, yeah, it's better to have a, a, a weasel in the woodshed than a um, stoat on your goat. And if you want to know what the difference is between a a stoat and a weasel. It's, it's, it, they say in Fartwell that uh, a weasel is reasonably distinguishable and a stoat is totally different. So there you go. So the moral of that story is, 
if you fancy going on strike, watch out because you might need a snorkel and mask and then you can't drink your pink gin. No. Cheers, everybody. Toodaloo for now. Yes, yes, yes. Sun's gone past the yard arm. I'm Baron Borshyster, and it's time for another fable from Fartwell. So cheers, everybody. Oh, box. Yes, yes, yes. I'm Baron Borshyster. Oh, fuck it. So here we go. And I'll, oh shit. Just spilling the old pink gin everywhere. So, so I'll, yes, so off we go and we're gonna mend this jigsaw, yes. And the moral of that story is, uh, the moral of that story is, oh, oh, for fuck's sake, what is the moral of the story?